What is up, my friends? Welcome to the second annual Ben and Griff's Holiday Gift Guide. We are gonna break down our favorite choices in five different categories. Five categories. So we're gonna do stocking stuffer, a under $50, an under $100, a 250 category, a 500 category, I lied, and a thousand category. Already I can't do math. It's cool. Six different categories. So if you are looking for the ultimate gift for a loved one, a friend, or just for yourself, and you wanna see what Griff and I would buy, join us, let's have some fun. Welcome to the Hookup Tackle. The Hookup Tackle is the world's largest showcase of Mega Bass products, featuring baits and colors not found at any other dealer. The Hookup also offers a wide display of OSP, Evergreen, Depths, Lucky Craft, Jackal, and many more. The Hookup Tackle is owned and operated by family, is staffed by guides and verified tackle nerds who love helping anglers elevate their craft. If you're in the Phoenix area, we'd love to have you stop by our showroom and check out the wonderful world of Mega Bass and the hookup for yourself. If you shop online, there are almost 10,000 SKUs of Mega Bass products alone with hundreds of other companies and new products being added daily. So next time you're looking for that hard to find bait, that color your fish have never seen before, or maybe you just wanna elevate your game, look at thehookuptackle.com. Cheers, my friends. Welcome back to the Hookup Tackle. I am Ben with the Hookup Tackle, Tackle Taku on Instagram, being joined by my buddy Griff G Sticks Bespoke on Instagram, and our other buddy Jeffrey the King over there. No beer drinking, Jeffrey the King. What's up, Jeffrey the King? How's it going? It's going good. Would you like a beer? No. Griff, would you like a beer? No. <laughs> okay. Cheers, my friends. Damn you for not drinking, Jeff. Hey, you guys can sit here and not have any fun and be bums. Hmm. Huh. Party on this side of the frame. Okay, should we jump in? I'm insulted. Why are you looking at me like you that? You should Jim? down that. Get look. I'm not get trying down. to get I'm not trying to get drunk. Get down. You you need to relax. All right. Let's jump in. Six <laughs> categories apparently. Let's go. Okay. So what Griff and I did last year and it was fun, so we decided to do it again this year, is we walked the store together and with with diff well, with six different missions yeah. involved. If we were looking to just get a stocking stuffer or two, what would that be? If we were looking to just spend, you know, 50 bucks or less on somebody, what would that be? 100 bucks or less, so on and so forth, right? So we're gonna fly through the categories. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's start with stocking stuffers. Let's do it. You good? Yep. Okay. Well, I'm gonna start, okay? So first things first, you can never go wrong with one of these bad boys. So this is a uh, gift card to our store. You can get them in any denomination. So if you just love them a little bit, you can get them like a $10 gift card. If you love them a lot, knock yourself out, right? So this is easy to fit in any stocking. It comes electronically. So even if you wait to the last minute, you can get it in your hands, put it in the stocking, and that'd be great. So this is the no brainer. If you just can't decide what to get them, start there. What do you got? So my first choice here is frogs can't really go wrong with a frog there's many different choices of frogs in the store uh, you know in between like 10 and 20 dollars you can get a nice frog for somebody else and who doesn't love frog fishing right yeah, yeah. and these are two of our favorites you throw the care all the time yes this is I love the botcher X either of these would be great for anybody to pull out yeah so if you don't know if you don't really know what you're doing and this is truly what you're going to buy off of We've got you. We went around to make sure that everything we show you is actually legit, that whoever your loved one is that's getting it is yeah. gonna be like, yes. Yeah, they're, they're well known, things that work really well. Yep. And most people have fished one or two of these a time in their life anyway. Yeah, I think so. There you go. Yeah, okay, moving on. I'm gonna stay with the hookup tackle idea here for a minute. How about a pack of stickers? So you can do one, you can do a whole pack, but everybody loves stickers. I was gonna say, especially if you're a kid, but I think I use stickers more than my kids, but these are dishwasher safe, they're UV safe, so they can put them on their water bottle, you can put them on your car, and they're gonna last for years. So that's an easy thing to drop in a stocking. You take it. All right, so the sleeper gill is one of the hottest baits that we had this year. Uh, people have been wanting them for a long time. Uh, it'll make a great stocking stuffer, it'll fit right in there and then anybody will love pulling this out of their stocking. Yeah, easy. All right, I'm gonna go a little bougie, Jeff. All right. So I am choosing a pair of electric sunglasses. Now, 
You wear electric sunglasses. I do. You wear electric sunglasses. I do. I also wear electric sunglasses. Definitely my favorite sunglass that we've that we've ever carried and that I've ever had. I chose this because they come packed in a really small box that's easy to fit in a stocking. So if you're looking for something elevated and more expensive to put in the stocking, this would be the option. They're gonna run you 150 to 250 bucks depending on what you get. What you get in electric sunglasses that you don't get in other glasses is their HD lens is just unbelievable. Just what you can see with this lens is crazy. So I'd highly recommend it if you're buying for yourself, surprise yourself in your stocking. But yeah. if you're looking for a really nice gift for somebody, this is a great way to go. And I know that buying sunglasses can be difficult online. Don't ever feel like you're stuck with them. So if you get something and it doesn't fit, it's too small, too big, whatever, just reach out to us and we'll take them back. But you can't really go wrong with the electrics. I would go with a gray or a bronze lens. Those are gonna be the most universal. Unless you're looking specifically for sight fishing, then go with yellow. Okay, mm -hmm. what yeah. do you got? All right, so shad style baits have been hitting pretty good around the US right now in this uh, winter cold water. <laughs> <laughs> Had to throw that in there. Yeah. It gets in the 60s. Yeah, so the, yeah. Meg the Mega Bass I buy Shad is my favorite. Again, it would fit in the stocking really neat. Super uh, small, super small, super compact. And yeah. then anything with a Mega Bass logo on it, people are gonna be excited. Yeah, for sure. And then while we're on that, might as well throw that one in there yeah. too. Then obviously a Vision 110. Everybody knows the Vision 110. Everybody knows the jerk bait, and everybody would be happy to get one. Yeah, and you can't go wrong with any color in that line. Yep. Okay, a couple more and we will move on to the next category. Alabama rigs are super popular. This is one that I throw pretty much all spring and summer. This is the Hog Farmer Mop Deuce Rig. I chose this because it's easy to fit in a stocking. It's a really nice rig. There's only two hooks on it, so no matter where you live in the country, it should be legal uh, within your laws. The rest of the arms are all blades, so it looks like a whole school of fish. That's a killer thing to get in a stocking. I would love it if I got it. Also me. And then... I have to buy 60 a year. <laughs> True. And then you threw a ton of hooks over here, but terminal tackle, you really can't go wrong with. Yeah, terminal tackle. Uh, everybody needs terminal tackle. Yeah. But it's one of the things we think about the least. True. Right? We yep. want the cool baits, we want this and we want that. Yep. But, I mean, you got to replace the hooks when they get worn out, or if you don't trust the hooks, you got to replace them, right? Yeah. So. so if you just can't decide on something or want to just get a bunch of little things, anything from Ryugi, anything from Zappu, anything from OSP, anything from Owner, any of those brands, they're gonna be very happy with. Oh yeah. So knock it out, easy to fit in. Yep. Are you ready for the next category? Let's do it. Okay. All right guys, on to our first price category. This is the $50 50. price category. So if you wanna spend 50 or less and get some dope stuff, we went around the store and found what we thought were the coolest things you can get. Now, some of those things were also in the stocking stuffer. Yeah, absolutely. So, I mean, you, again, you can't go wrong with a 110 and some of that other stuff. But here's where we would go, okay? I'm gonna start. Custom color Lucky Craft baits. So we do a handful of custom colors with Lucky Craft in some of their more popular baits. And right now we've got Pointer 100s, we have Pointer 78s, we have LV 500s, LV 150s, Anything that you get in an Essa Don or an Essa Wakasagi would be a great gift. Oh. Any Anybody that gets it would know it's coming from the shop. It's the only place in the world that you can get these colors. So you can pick something up for 15, 16, 17 bucks that's actually limited edition, which is pretty dope. So you could even grab a handful of them and still be in that $50 range. So that would be number one for me. What do you got? Boom. So Ray makes these pretty cool. I would call them upsized baits not really giant but like these baits these top water baits and stuff like that these are these are great they're fun to fish and you, people have a good time with these yeah uh, so again under fifty dollars for each of these pretty dope so the, the dodge is like the most popular crawler right now in japan it's starting yeah. to catch on here in the u.s the gi jeff you caught them really good on the gi before we even brought in raid yep and it's definitely become one of our best sellers so not, you can't really go wrong with any of the colors, but there's some limited colors in both of those as well Yes. right now. Yeah. So that's a great option. I'm going to jump over to swim bait for a minute. So you, know, you can never go wrong 
getting somebody a swim bait. One of our favorite baits in the shop is a working class Zero Citizen. Now, right now we have two different colors in stock. We have the Heckler and Misfit, and we have them both in six inch and seven inch. Okay, so depending on where you're at or what you wanna do, uh, you can scoop any of these up. Nobody would be upset to get a Citizen. Citizens are very, very difficult to get. They're only done in limited batches. So if this is under a tree at all, the person's gonna be stoked. So there you go, there's next option for me under 50 bucks, the Working Class Zero Citizen. All right, next up we got the Mega Bass Mega Dog X. So this is this is a downsized version of the me the Mega Dog, yeah. but still a big bait. Uh, you know, another fun one. This one's gonna be ready for you guys as soon as the springtime hits. Uh, the ice starts melting and the water starts warming up. Fun bait. Uh, so I've learned that every fish is want gonna want to hit it. Mm. I've got many fish about the size of the bait. That interesting. Yeah. So it's got a ton of draw power. The fish the fish love it. And it's a cool bait to put under under the Christmas tree. What's also cool about this particular bait is Mega Bass does limited batches of fine art series colors. Mm, yeah. Which is a hand painted process that's like a just an elevated artsy paint job. Yeah. These are actually available in some fine art colors like the fine art radio that you have, which is pretty cool. So yeah. that would make a very nice gift to get yep. that. Cool. All right. For me, this is gonna go on, to me, the fun side, which I don't do very often. This is more your lane. I've been on the fun side this whole episode. That's what I'm saying. You're yeah. always on the fun side. I don't do it very often. I'm more the practical guy. But this is a cool bait that I think is both fun and effective. This is from Wild Lures. This is the Wild Lures Bullet. Okay, so this is a topwater bait that's literally shaped like a big bullet right? Like a casing and a bullet. You can buy additional props for the end if you want it to have more of a swoosh or a plopping type sound. As it comes like this, it is a solid foam constructed by hand, uh, super durable walking bait. So it's going to have a really nice plop to it as it moves. And it's a little crazy because it's shaped like a bullet. But once you get past the idea that it's a bullet, it's just a walking topwater bait. Well, it's pure fun, right? 100%. It, yeah. Everybody can. Everybody throws a walking bait, right. but who throws one a Shaped bullet? Shaped like a bullet, yeah. yeah. Called a bullet, and it, I mean, everything about it's a bullet. So if you want to have a little fun, it's in a cool little package. It's very JDM. That's from Wild Lures, the Wild Lures bullet. 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 All right, so I'm gonna go with the Evoke 150, all right? Last year we got the 120 in. Now we have the giant brother to it, the Evoke 150. Mm -hmm. This is a uh, a prop style bait you're going to cast it out and reel it in it's going to churn on the water you can rip it you can burn it you can fish it real slow uh this size right here is going to cast a mile so you're going to be able to cover a ton of water with it and then you know it's a top water bait again and who doesn't love fishing top water yeah so if your you know loved one is a swim bait guy this is the size if your loved one is just like a pond fisherman this is also a cool size yeah if he's somewhere in between also a cool size. So this is like the universal size that anybody, no matter what your person's into, unless they're into like crappie fishing, they probably won't be happy. Yeah, when you see but, it, you're like, oh, there's no way a fish is gonna eat it. So right. when they do eat it, you're like, they smoke it. Uber yeah. excited. Yeah, cool. All right, up next in the $50 category, everybody loves clothing, right? Yeah. It's a perfect time to gift. So you can always go with a hookup logo hat. There are tons of options or you could go with a super sick uh, Stockton Art, the Hookup Tackle Collab logo on a Sims SolarTech Sun shirt. So they're under 50 bucks, a killer logo. Everybody would love uh, that shirt, great sun protection. So hat, shirt, either way, good options. Ooh. There is the $50 category. Let's go to the next one. Plus, we're gonna have the introduction of our first mystery box. Mystery. So, you ready for the 100? Let's do All it. All right, let's do it. All right, Griff, are you ready for the $100 category? Let's do it. Okay, if you wanna throw 100 bucks at a gift, and this is 100-ish, Yeah, ish okay? So it's not necessarily below 100, it's just 100-ish. So somewhere around 100 bucks, these are what we would think would be the best options. Yes. Okay, so, you wanna start? Yeah. Okay, what do you got? All right, so. Sims jacket. Okay. All right. So I wear this jacket all the time. The Sims CX hoodie. Uh, it's a you know custom logo on there. Mm -hmm. Super comfortable jacket. 
Uh, I love wearing this around the house and indoors. It's a little bit cold outside for this specific jacket right now, but as the weather warms up a little bit, it's a great indoor jacket or a cool like spring morning jacket. Yeah. It's super dope. Comes in two different colors. Pretty sick. It's a super comfortable one. I actually wear this every morning when I get up. Yeah, this Where it's is... kind of cool in the morning because it's like super fleecy inside. Yeah. I this, dig that jacket. This is the first thing I reach for when I wake up. Totally, in the morning. totally. Yeah. But they all smell like weed. Okay. <laughs> Moving on. My first pick in the $100 category would be another custom color. So we do this great custom color collab with Bait Sandy. Now this is on the Bait Sandy Explorer Glide. This is our custom color, Zombie Shadow, or Zombie Shad. So this is available in a one-time run. We are slowly running out, so this is the last of the batch. Uh, there will hopefully still be plenty to get through the Christmas season, but if you're looking to get a glide for under 100 bucks, Bait Sandy crushes the under 100. You throw the Bait Sandy stuff a lot. Yeah, I think it's I think it's the best deal in glide baits price-wise, right? Some Depending on where you're fishing, you may have to customize it a little bit, but you're still gonna be under $100 after that. Yep. But I mean, it's super dope. Yep. It catches a ton of fish. Yep. And it's a one of a time, a one of a kind color. So, you know, anybody that you give this to would know it comes from here. It's the only place in the world to get it. Yep. So, Zombie Shad Explorer, that's my first choice. Okay, what you got, guy? All right, so I'm going to stay on the fun side of things. Okay, shocker. And I'm going to talk about a crawler. Okay. All right. Not everybody is fishing a crawler right now and yep. they're missing out. Yep. All right. So, the Deca Dodge is a bigger crawler that we carry in the store. The NZ Crawler is the bigger version of the NZ Crawler Junior, of, of course. Yep. And then, um, <clears throat> super fun bait to use. Yep. Uh, if you like, if you're like a swim baiter and you want to throw something a little bit smaller. You had an eye wing over here too, but I just you ran out of hands. Yeah. So these are your these are your favorite ones. Yeah. Okay. Eye wing. The eye wing is my top favorite. I've been catching a ton on the Deca Dodge. And it's big and it's cool and it's yeah. super JDM, pretty new. Yeah. Yeah. Super sick. Cool. Uh, if you want to have a lot of fun and get explosive bites, the crawler is a good way to go. Anybody that, that gets this gifted to them is gonna love it. Cool, awesome. All right, I'm gonna stay on the bigger side for a minute and I'm gonna talk about some glide bait style. Okay, so where Griff was on the surface, I'm gonna go subsurface a little bit. So there are some great glide bait options and crank down options in that $100-ish price range. So Slide Swimmer 175 or Silent Killer 175, both killer baits in that $100 price range. We have quite a few colors in stock right now. You could even grab something like an Imakatsu Replicator. We have some custom colors in Gancraft Jointed Claws in stock right now. Uh, so you could do the Jointed Claw 148, the Jointed Claw 178. There's some great, there's some great options in there below a hundred bucks in some really hard to find colors. Yeah. So again, if your loved one likes bigger baits or maybe you like bigger baits, any of these would be great options under a hundred bucks. There you go, glide baits for sure for me. All right, you got a big thing on your lap. I got a thing, corn. Okay, so for those of you guys who love tackle storage, yep. right? there's some people that are really into it. We have this duo uh, live well slash box thing, all right? It's, it's a pool balkin. Yeah, what he said. Okay. All right, it's a box, it's a big box. And it's got stuff in it. Oh. Good job, you're supposed to preview that. It's a, oh yeah, the one box I grabbed is a <laughs> fucked up one <laughs> out of the 60 there in the shop. All right, so. Take it, two. It's a soft plastic bag, box, like, it, but it holds a ton of stuff. How many boxes do we fit in here? We fit 25 in here the other day. So like 25, 3,500 size boxes yeah, in here. Crazy. Yeah, crazy. Um, I had to grab a couple of these for my house. Like the storage was getting insane, mm. so I had to organize and these are perfect for me. Yep. But these will fit in a boat. Yep. These are easy They're to fully take. sealed. Yeah. Right, so if you want to put water inside or outside, they're fully sealed, so nothing's going to creep in. Or if you want to use it like a live well, you could. Nothing's going to creep out. Yeah. Uh, there is that mesh liner in there as well. So if you do store a bunch of stuff, this zips on top to keep it from falling out. Or if you want to put lighter stuff uh, on the mesh, you can as and your well. Fish won't flop out like if you have a flounder in there. Yeah. Good okay. To go. So there you go. <laughs> what a great option. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Flounder guys are going crazy, Jeff. There's a picture of a farmer. 
Or is that a, a, a halibut? All right, and that brings us to the da, da, da. first mystery box of the season. Now, last year, Griff and I, kind of as a joke, yeah. did these mystery boxes. So this is Ben and Griff's mystery box. Essentially what it is, there's gonna be several different categories. So this is category number one. If you trust us, give us a hundred bucks, we're gonna make you a killer box, okay? So it's a hundred dollar mystery box. Griff and I are gonna walk around together. We're gonna pull and fill it to what we would want it to be for a hundred bucks. And you're gonna get our autographs. So you gotta beat Jeff to this box because we're gonna sign every box. So there you go, $100 Ben and Griff mystery box. Those are available now. Let's go. You good? <laughs> All right. All right, moving on to our next category, the $250 category. 250 Okay, That's so cool. now you're starting to love this person a little bit, Yeah. right? 250-ish is what we're going for. So we tried to shoot from 100 to 250. Okay. So that kind of in between, some of these might be just slightly over that. 250, but they're right in that mark. I'll jump in and start. For me, one of the dopest things in the store for 250 bucks is a Mega Bass Orochi Triple X multi piece rod. Okay, now 250 bucks if you are an angler that fishes urban. I keep multi piece rods in my car all the time. I drive my kids downtown. Sometimes I just gotta kill an hour or two so I can just grab my rod, go fish a little urban park, and then go pick them back up. If you travel, if you fly on planes, anything like that, in the Orochi Triple X line, there's a great spinning rod and a great bait casting rod that are both designed to be just all around use and they fold into this pack. For 250 bucks, kind of a no brainer. That would be number one for me. Okay. What do you got there, guy? So I have the Mega Bass Levante rod, mm -hmm. all right? This is a sick rod series. Uh, the, the Levante and the Orochi are pretty much the same rods, but they're different, Yeah. right? Yeah. So at $250, it's a well underpriced rod. Uh, it's a great rod for everybody who just loves fishing. There's quite a bit of options in there, so you have a rod for everything. Super sick. Yeah, and I should preface that if you guys are buying rods for loved ones and you don't know what to do shoot shoot me a dm or shoot griff a dm on instagram call the yeah. store come into the store we can help you find the right one and no matter what after christmas if they're like oh i already have that model we'll just swap it out for another model yep. yeah so don't ever feel like you can't pull the trigger on something like this we got you yes okay all right next for me now i'm gonna be the bad guy mm. okay so I'm a huge fan, I'm a huge bag whore. I've talked about it before. I basically own every bag ever built. It's, I was cleaning out my garage today. I'm completely out of control. So there are a couple of great bags in this price range. One that I fish a lot, like this, we are basically twinning for a long time with this bag. This is the Depths Body Bag. So this is a great sling pack. Uh, it's got Velcro that it attaches, and then you basically just throw it over your body reattach it with the Velcro and it's on. You can store all your stuff. I guarantee you, you can put way too much stuff in this bag. Yes. So I think I loaded mine with like 50 pounds of gear, but there's all kinds of internal compartments in here. You can put big boxes, you can put small bags. There's lots of, you know, internal ways that you can keep yourself organized or not if you're me, you just throw everything in there. So that's a great option. It's Another not a live well. Not a live well, thank you for that. Another great option is the OSP messenger bag. So this is a killer, killer bag as well. This is my daily bag that I actually keep my laptop in now, but it's designed for tackle storage. It's got easy access. Everything's padded in here, so you're not gonna crush anything or break anything. Or if you're just looking for a super sick laptop bag, yeah. it will fit a 14 inch and under laptop okay yeah. so if you've got like a macbook air or something like that it fits in here cool and you got this cool osp bag yeah. as well and then tons of little you know there's tons of molly webbing d rings i mean you can deck this thing out like crazy available in two colors that's for me all right what do you got now we're going back to the fun side rats hmm. there you go so the pb rat is my favorite rat your favorite rat yeah for Jeff? sure always has been yeah. yeah so the pb rat super fun 
rat to fish with. Every, everybody knows what it is. Yeah. A lot of people are kind of scared to pull the trigger on it. Yep. Right? This would be a really cool gift. Yeah. Yeah. So that guy who's who's like right on the fence, you just got to get it for him and force him to have it. Yep. Agreed. Yeah. And there's a bunch of really crazy colors right now. Yeah. Kind of one-off colors, so it's a great time to buy them. They're available in a two-piece and a three-piece. So depending on how big you want to get, if you're not sure what to get, get the three-piece. Yes, absolutely. That's what I would do. I think it's only like 10 bucks more, but it's it's the coolest one. Yeah. Two, the two-piece is dope, and sometimes you need the two-piece to get bit, but if you're buying as a gift, you can't ever go wrong with the three. Yes. Yeah, cool. What else you got over there? So I'm gonna stay in the same category. Okay. All right. Yep. So <laughs> that was close. So when it landed on your lap. Who's been drinking? Uh. So these. Ow, ow. These are new to us, uh, but not new to the fishing world. All right. These have been around. So this is the Rafa Custom Baits Little Boy. Right. Okay. Yep. Yep. Little Boy Wake. Little boy wake, all right. Mm -hmm. Super sick wake bait. It's like a mid-size wake bait, but it has a loud sound to it and a ton of action. This one is pretty sick. I'm I'm super stoked to go throw this. It's a really cool one. Yeah. It's got a really nice sound. It's a it's a subtle sound, but a distinct sound. By the way, after we were messing with it the other day, we did measure it. So it's six inches from the very tip to the very tip, mm. and it's 2.75 ounces. Okay. Okay, so it's a super easy one to throw on any like light duty swim bait gear. It, you guys will have no problem chucking yeah. it around. You can even throw it on something like a poker or a dragoon or something like that. You could easily throw it. Yeah, and the yeah. paint jobs are sick on these things. Yeah. Handcrafted, hand painted, hand tested. It's a sick wake. Yep. Yeah. And each one's going to come with a spare tail. Yep. Cool. That's a great option. Yes. All right. I'm going to jump over to reels for a second. So if you're looking to get something a little higher end, in that $200 price range, 199, 209, 219, something like that. You can't go wrong with these two reels right here. So this is the Daiwa Tatula SVT Wing 103. Yep. This is our best selling reel year in and year out in the store. This is a an amazing one for a beginner. If you have a beginner fisherman that's wanting to get into bait casting, this is the one to get him. Do not get him something less expensive. This is gonna give him all the cast control that he needs to actually succeed. Yes. If you have an advanced angler, this is gonna have all of the cast control and the features that they would want as well. So it's just a, this is a no brainer. Okay, so 200 bucks, no brainer. On the spinning side, the Kage LT, again this year, is our number one spinning reel. Now, this is a reel that's built specifically for pro shops, so you can't buy it online. Yeah. So if you want this, you're gonna need to reach out to us, call us, we'll drop our phone number down below in the description. But what's dope about this reel, it's just a very you know compact spinning reel. It's got a great drag system, uh, but it's all just, it's matte black, it's got just this little bit of Japanese core kit to it. It's just sleek. It's, it's sexy, it matches any rod. So, you know, definitely our best selling reel. It comes in a 2500 size that I'm holding here, which would be ideal for a bass fisherman. Mm -hmm. It also comes in a 2000 and a 1000 size if you have a trout fisherman, a crappie fisherman, pan fisherman, something like that. That would be a dope option. So, there you go, a couple reels for me. There you go. And last one for me is the Depths Slide Swimmer 250. Hmm. All right. It's a big swim bait. Everybody should know what a Depths 250 is. It's been around for a long time. People love it. Yep. Catches a ton of fish. Uh, for Jeff, I've never caught a fish on it. <laughs> Ben's caught a couple. It's a great. It's a great glide bait. Yeah. We've got a ton of colors in stock yeah. right now. So if you are looking to just buy a nice bigger lure that's completely functional, we're going to talk about some bigger lures that are just a little crazy yeah. here in a minute. But a bigger lure that's completely functional that you can go out and actually use, this is probably one of the best ones in the shop. Yeah, yeah. it's it's so intriguing and it's so cool when you see everybody using it and yep. catching. Like I've bought a few of these. Yep. Like I'm slowly trying to like collect them. Yeah. But I I can't I can't throw it yet. They'll I haven't come, thrown one yet. They'll come a time. Yeah. But yeah. they look cool on my rack. Yeah. Sick. <laughs> All right. So there you go. One more lure option in this category, and that'll set you back uh, 169 bucks. Right, so you're well below that 250 yes. price range. But back to the 250 price range, Jeff. Are you ready? Ta-da! 
our next mystery box. So the Ben and Griff mystery box for $250. So if you trust us with 250 of your dollars, we will go around and build you the coolest box we can build you for 250 bucks. So there you go. There is mystery box number two. Yeah. Are you ready for the third? Let's do it. Okay, let's go. All right, guys, we are moving on to the next product category. This is the $500 category. So now you really love this person. All right, this is, in my world, Jeff, these are the levels. Mm. All right, so now I'm gonna feel loved. Love, right? okay. Yeah. 500 bucks, they, they love me. So anytime we talk about a $500 category, mm -hmm. this is our annual time <laughs> to, to talk you. about some handcrafted horse leather manifold glide baits, okay? So manifold, we talk about it literally once a year, mm -hmm. right? Because this is a, this is a really cool brand over in Japan. One of the nicest anglers that you'll really ever meet. And he makes some crazy stuff. And this is definitely cool factor 100. Yeah. Functionality probably like 20%. Okay, now, does it fish? Oh, it, absolutely, it glides great. It does everything it's designed to do, but it's a big ass bait and it is basically made like a high-end, you know, purse. couture purse. Yeah, thank you, would be made. So hand-stitched horse leather. Can you smell it? Does it nope. smell like horse? 100%, yeah, smell it. Just like the barn. It's just like being out in Yellowstone. You're not gonna sniff my bait. Not your white ass. Sniff my bait. Long, thirteen-inch, dangly thing. Okay. Smells this is really taking a turn. So there you go. There are a couple of color options, a couple of size options, a couple different frame options. You can get a Yugo frame or non-Yugo frame. But as far as a unique gift goes, this is definitely super high up there. Okay. Yeah. Definitely one of the more unique things that you can get. Very few of these are made every year. So there you go. From Manifold, Manifold Glide. What do you got there, sir? So I like to put this in the category of ridiculous, but awesome. Okay. Right? So the Depths Gira Gira Kogeki. Yeah. All right? Apparently 500 bucks just means big as shit. Yeah, I yeah. guess. what we're going as with. As big as you can get. Yeah. Well, it's it's pretty sick, right? <laughs> it's a super dope bait, but it's ridiculous. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's kind of ridiculous, but <laughs> there's someone that wants it. And again, yeah. on the fence, like, oh, should I get it or should I not? Like, get it as a gift, you have to take it. Yep, and then right. they have to throw it, they have to use it, they're gonna love it, yeah. and then you're gonna get hugs. Yeah, Yeah. so this one is giant. It's, uh, how, how much does it weigh? It's too big. Like 17 pounds. Yeah. So, I think it's 14 inches and 11 ounces, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. So it weighs so a pound. It's a lot. It's a lot of bait, but it's <laughs> super sick. Good math, by the way. Yeah. Okay. Good. <laughs> Jeff, you're awake? Good to see you, buddy. How is that? How is that off? It wasn't. Oh no, you nailed it. <laughs> how about another rod? Mega Bass Valkyrie World Expedition. Now, this is another travel rod. Okay, these are multi-piece rods that are designed the same way a Valkyrie rod is designed. They are glass carbon composites, but they're super light. Super. So they're very lightweight. They're very strong. They make some shorter lengths that are perfect for throwing reaction baits like crankbaits, jerk baits, that kind of stuff. Their longer lengths and heavier powers are really money for swim baits, glide baits, some of those crawlers that we were talking about earlier. So if you guys are looking for just a really cool reaction bait rod that's very strong, very light, you can't really go wrong with the Valkyrie World Expedition line. They're gonna be 350 to 380 depending on which model, but they're they're super sick. I've had a couple of these since they came out and they've stayed attached the whole time in my oh. boat. So absolutely love them. That would be a good choice for me. Good what do you got there, guy? All right. So let's talk about P5s. Okay. All right. The P5 is probably our best selling series of rods that we have in the shop. Mm -hmm. uh, there's a rod for every technique. There's a rod for, for every person. There's different sizes in, in many techniques also, right? Yep. So depending on what you're trying to do, how you're fishing from a boat or from the shore, there's definitely a rod for everybody. Yes, Yeah. and we grabbed these two rods to try to help just in case you're watching this and you're unsure of what rod to get. If you don't know, 
The Dark Sleeper rod that we have here is a 7-1. This is probably the single most versatile rod in that line. Yes. So if you were just gonna get one rod, this would be an amazing place to start. You can just do so many things with it. And then the Pop X stick, which is next to it, is a killer one for bait finesse. Bait finesse. So if you've heard your loved one talk about bait finesse or BFS fishing, this would be a super dope one to get for them. And that's gonna segue into my next pick too. I also have another bait finesse rod. This is gonna be a multi-piece bait finesse rod. So where that Pop X was a single piece. This is gonna be a multi-piece from Fishman. Okay, now this is one of the more popular uh, multi-piece brands in Japan. This is the uh, Beams Blanc Sierra. This is a 5.2 ultra light, just a beautiful rod. It's got like a wood grain Fuji reel seat on here. This rod is just so whippy at the top end that you can do these little, just like little wrist flick type casts and your shit goes forever. Forever. So if you want something just a little bit different in a multi-piece, so it's super easy to uh, travel with or hike with or do anything like that, uh, it's a dope one in that $500 range. That's from Fishman. And then while we're on rods, we can't talk about rods without talking about reels. So a few of our more popular reels uh, fit in this $500 category. So from Japan, the Metanium Shallow Edition. This is a JDM only, one of our best-selling metaniums, uh, one of our best-selling reels in the store. It's the same size as the regular metanium, but it's got a shallower spool, so it's gonna cast easier for lighter weight stuff. Skips great, just a beautiful reel, and it's available in a right hand and left hand. For the bait finesse guys, the Aldebaran BFS would be an amazing one. It's just a super solid reel that just, it's just a multi-function BFS that can basically do everything. Yes. And then for you non-BFS guys, the Daiwa Steez A T-Wing HLC, HLC is a really cool one. So the HLC Steez is designed to cast heavy baits a long way. Okay, so this is a distance casting reel. It's a beautiful reel. It's designed just like the Steez A. It does have the mag seal. It's got all the advanced cast control in it, but it's designed specifically with the spool and the braking system to just bomb long casts with heavier baits. So deep crankbait, Carolina rig, swim bait, a big spoon, something that you're just bombing out there. This is a sick, sick reel made in Japan. It's JDM only. It's really cool. That would be my next choice. Yeah, stick real. All right, and finally in this category, we have the $500 Ben & Griff mystery box. Mystery. So you gotta really start trusting us now. Yeah. So give us 500 bucks. We're gonna fill an amazing box for you. So if you trust us, probably me more, okay? This would be a great gift to get. And again, you get Griff's autograph, which is pretty much worth 500 bucks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, at yeah. least. Yeah, so there you go. To wrap up the $500 category, the $500 mystery box is available now. One more category to go, Jeff. Let's go. All right, guys, the final category of the evening. This is the you really love the person category. Yeah. $1,000 category. So this is a $1,000-ish category might be slightly over might be a little less but this is in our opinion the very best high ticket items in the store i'm gonna start start okay by the way this category is pretty much gonna be rots yeah. and something special at the end all right depths sidewinder this is one of the coolest rods in the store a, because cosmetically, it's just clean and super sleek and beautiful. B, because it is a super highly functional rod, yeah. right? So this is the boa constrictor. We have several options in stock, but this is a killer one for throwing a buzz bait, a small swim bait, square bill, some bigger top water. It'd be a sick one for the uh, Evoke Zero, Yes. right? But the other thing that's dope about it is that there's hardly any of these in the world. Depths makes very few sidewinders. Almost none of them make it to the US. So if you're looking for a really niche gift yeah. that nobody else is going to have, this would be a killer one. It's gonna be priced right in that $700 price range, but Depths makes amazing rods. So sidewinder, that's number one on my list. 
What do you got there, guy? All right, so I have here the Gancraft Dead Sword Magnum. Cool. All right, Gancraft makes amazing rods. They do. But these Dead Swords are super sick, right? So this is the rod that was made for the uh, the Gancraft Jointed Claw 230. All right, uh, specific for a 230, but obviously you can throw whatever you feel like. Rated two to five ounces. It's, it's a sick rod. It's got the perfect action on there. Um, this is would be a great rod to throw some of those uh, wake baits. For sure. Crawlers. The PB yep. rat on this thing would be would sick. Would be dirty. Yeah. Yeah. It's got super unique styling to it. I mean, there's only one rod in the world that's styled like this. Yeah. And it's that rod. Yes. Yeah. So that's a great option. I'm gonna stay in a similar weight rod here for a second. This is a Mega Bass Destroyer Evolution White Python. White Python. Now, the White Python is another one that's perfect for all the same things that Griff just mentioned. Three eighths to four ounce lure rating on this, so it's perfect for a rat. I've been using this as my rat rod for a while. Small glide. Jeff and I even took one of these to Michigan through a little A rig. We threw a three quarter and a one ounce dark sleeper on it even. So there's a lot of things you can do with this rod, but this is probably one of the more aggressive JDM styled rods. You've got a chrome reel seat, you got these sick ass carbon metal lockdowns, this sick gold copper, you know, paint scheme. I mean, this rod just screams badass. Yeah. Okay, so for the 649 price range, can't go wrong with that. That's the white python. So next rod for me is going to be the Mega Bass TS Destroyer Poker. All right, seven foot two, uh, rated up to three ounces. All right, and everybody that watches the channel knows that we love to throw the frog on this rod. Yep, All right. best frog rod ever, I think. Yeah, so I'm also throwing like some soft swim baits on there. I threw the burrito last summer on this and it was I was having a good time with it. Yep. Uh, this is going to be my six inch citizen rod this season. Uh, it's super compact, but dude, it is sick. There's so much power to it. It's a really easy rod to fish. You know, some rods are just, they almost are intuitive to what you're thinking. Yeah. Like you think your your body is saying cast right there and the rod actually does it. Yes. Right? And some rods you you end up fighting. This is one of those just kind of becomes part of you and it's a, you can't go wrong with a poker. You can't. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna elevate it just one step above to, in my opinion, the bougiest rod in the shop. This is a Mega Bass Arms Super Legera. Now, if you guys aren't familiar with Arms Super Legera, these are handmade, custom-built rods. We have to order every single one of these rods as a custom-built rod. We choose what grip to put on them, whether we want it gloss carbon or matte carbon, whether we want it to be a left-hand contoured grip or a right-hand contoured grip. We choose the color of the spacings. We choose the color of the tip of the rod up here, whether it's red or purple or whatever. We choose if we want, how we want the script. We put dragons on everyone because yeah, right. dragons are fucking cool. Dragons are cool. Yeah. So this is it. This is the ultimate rod gift for somebody. These are 1100 bucks. Yes. Okay. But I will tell you, I have several of these in my lineup. And even though this rod is full of fashion and it, wow factor, they're one of the best fishing rods yes. that I've ever owned. The way they build these rods, they're incredibly durable. They're amazingly strong and you can just do so many things with them. Yeah. So take a look. There's a bunch of different models. If you have questions on whether you should get a left hand or a right hand, you could certainly ask us. What I say is if you fish behind the reel, if you put your reel here and you hold it here, then go with the hand that you hold the rod with. If you don't, if you usually fish up on the reel, then go with the hand that you cast with, right? So if you get a left hand because you cast with your left, right? That's what I would do or vice versa. But just beautiful rods. You can't go wrong with them. That's the arms super Laguerre. Uh-oh. All right. And finally, for those that are super trusting, oh. <laughs> the $1,000 mystery box. So if you really, really trust us, Griff and I will knock your socks off. We will walk around the store and make you just the sickest $1,000 box that we can make you. If you choose to purchase this, we will reach out to you 
and talk to you to make sure we understand what type of fishing you are doing yes. so that we build you the correct box. Yes. Okay. So if you're a smallmouth guy in New York, for instance, we want to build a box that's going to be perfect for you in New York versus a guy that's, you know, punching mats in South Florida. Yeah. Right. So trust us. I think you should. I think everybody last year was pretty blown away by the thousand dollar mystery boxes. So there are only a handful of these available. These are very time consuming for Griff and I to do. We put a lot of effort into this to yeah. make sure that we've built the box perfectly for you. So there you go. If you want the ultimate gift for yourself or your loved one, thousand dollar mystery box by Ben and Griff. Those are available now. A true box of fun. True box of fun. All right. And then you know what I think we should do? Yeah. Let's do Let's it. just see if anybody is really crazy enough. Like, Don't yeah. you think? Yeah. All right. If you guys really trust us, I'm going to take this thousand dollar mystery box. I'm going to add a comma and a zero. I'm only going to offer one of these because this is going to take a long time. If you want to do a $10,000 mystery box by Ben and Griff, we will do it for you. Okay. Yeah. Now I will tell you, if you go this route, we're going to put some rods in there. In reels. Okay. So, but again, we will talk to you, make sure we understand your fishing, make sure we understand what it is you're trying to accomplish. And we will build you the baddest box. It will probably be multiple boxes, Yeah. but we're just going to call it box. I don't think there's a big enough box. Boxes and tubes and boxes. For one person, you want a $10,000 mystery box. There you go. Available now, the ultimate Christmas gift. I want it. All right. That is a wrap. Cheers. No, oh, that's lame. Cheers, Jeff. That's lame too. Cheers, my friends. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Thanks for doing this with me. Oh, you're going to sign my beer can? There you go. What a bum. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, dude. I hope that was informative. If you guys have any questions for Griff or myself or Jeff, he's probably just not going to answer. Drop them down below in the comments. We will definitely get answers for you. Jeff is going to put links to pretty much everything we talked about here. So if you want to share this with a loved one, you certainly can. Guys, I hope you have a wonderful holiday season, a wonderful Christmas. Cheers to you. Thank you guys for the business. We will see you again soon. Until next time, peace out, my friends. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.